always a rainbow within reach on animal song. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Now I know my A, B, C, Next time, won't you sing with me? Now this time, let's sing together. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Now I know my A, B, C. Next time, won't you sing with me? That was lovely. Hello, friend. It's so good to see you. Excuse me, Mr. Goose. Yes, Fox? I'd like to take your picture with my camera. Smile! Fox, you just used the letter of the day. I did? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> uh, which letter did I use? The letter S. S makes the sound s in smile. <laughs> Listen. S, s, smile. <laughs> s, s, smile. <laughs> now you try. S, s, smile. <laughs> Super! I heard the letter of the day again. Me too! S -s -s Super! Sensational! Let's have a treasure hunt and find things that begin with S. Here are more things that begin with S. Snowflakes. S -s -s Snowflakes. Sun, s, s, sun. Sock, s, s, sock. P U. <laughs> snake, s, s, snake. Strawberries. Strawberries. What letter do all these words start with? S. That's right. The letter S. Yes. <laughs> Mr. Goo. 
Goose, can we trace a letter? Absolutely. Let's practice making the letter S. Who can think of a fun way to do it? I have an idea. Let's dig letters in the sand with a shovel. Well, that sounds like a great idea. Monkey, you go first. All right. <laughs> Great! I'll try next. <laughs> S. <laughs> Terrific tracing! Now, let's trace the lowercase letter. Nice job! I'll trace the next one. S. You did it! Let's look at the letters we made. What's this letter? S. Exactly. Uppercase S. And what's this letter? S. That's right, lowercase s. Nice job. Wow! Wow! Cool! Nice work, everybody. Thank you, Mr. Goose. It's me, Pig. Let's do a letter dance. Say S. S. All right. Say it again. S. Groovy. Let's dance. Letter S. Letter S. What's that letter? Letter S. Every letter makes a sound. together. Bye. Letter S. Letter S. What's that letter? letter? It's story time. Yay! Get around, everyone. What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called Hippo Wants to Dance. In this story, Hippo wants to dance. Will any of the other animals dance with her? Let's find out. Let's begin. Hippo wants to dance. Written by Marisa Stein and Sam Beck Bessinger. Illustrated by Megan Andrews. Hippo wants to dance. She jumps up and down on the dusty ground. Thump, thump. You're getting dirt on me, says Snake, sleeping in the sand. Go dance somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She rolls into the river and splashes her arms and legs. Splish, splash. You're making me wet, says Kingfisher, hunting for her breakfast. Go dance! Somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She twirls around and around in a field, kicking her legs up high. Swoosh! Swoosh! 
Be careful. You nearly kicked me, says Meerkat, bathing his babies. Go dance somewhere else. Hippo wants to dance. She flops into a puddle of mud and slides around on her nice big belly. Squish! Squash! Why don't you stop dancing, asks Donkey, carrying his buckets. Why can't you do something helpful instead? Hippo is sad. She is too sad to dance. She sits on a rock and cries. The tears roll down her cheeks and fall on the ground. Plop, plop. Grasshopper hears Hippo's tears. He starts dancing around her feet. Hop, hop. Hippo and Grasshopper start to dance. The other animals come to look. And they all dance together. The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids. Hello, Mr. Frog. Let's sing If You're Happy and You Know It. We don't know that song. Ah, you don't know it yet. I'll teach it to you. I'll sing the first verse, then you sing along with me. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Now, if you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Let's do all three. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! That was splendid. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Goodbye. Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. We're about to practice our counting together. Come on. One, two, three, four. Don't stop now. Let's count some more. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You're doing great. When we see some flowers or butterflies or stars, we count so we can find out how many things there are. Bum, ba, da, bum, bum. Let's look for things to count. Oh, I'm not very good at counting by myself. You're not very good yet. I'll help you. Let's count lily pads. One, two, three, four, five. Five lily pads. Now let's count Mr. Frog's hats together. One, two, three. How many in all? Three? Yeah, you got it. Now 
of you try, Hedgehog. Count the musical instruments. Okay. One, two, three, four. So how many in all? Four. You did it. Thanks, Monkey. Hey, I have an idea. Let's count all the cattails. Yeah! That may take a while. See you soon. Hmm, this is tricky. Oh, there it is. And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> Time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Hey, diddle diddle, the cat. And the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport, and the dish ran away with the spoon. Sports.